purpose of this ministry to reach out to a lost and dying world with the wonderful news of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. We purpose to welcome and affirm all people without regard to age, race, skin color, nationality, land of origin, first language, sexual orientation, gender identification, profession, or financial status. Yes. We believe that faith in the gospel is what identifies identifies a child of God, and not adherence to any creed or compliance with any code or mandate. We believe all who sincerely seek to know and serve the Lord in truth are welcome at the Master's table yes. without exception. The message of the Gospel is rooted in grace, love, and compassion. We purpose to demonstrate and function within these things. Yes. We purpose to minister to everyone who is in need spiritual or material. We purpose to feed the hungry, visit the sick, encourage the imprisoned, provide for the poor, clothe the naked, house the homeless, nurture and guide the young, care for the elderly, comfort the dying, and embrace those hurt and rejected by their own families and faith communities. Yes. If you have entered this church today having been wounded or offended by others who call themselves Christians, Please know for a fact that here you are welcomed, loved, accepted, affirmed, and safe. Our purpose is summed up in the, this passage from God's Word. Romans 14, 12 through 14. So then, every one of us shall give account of himself to God. Yes. Let us not, therefore, judge one another any more, but judge this, rather that no man put a stumbling block or an occasion to fall in his brother's way. I know and am persuaded by the Lord Jesus, oh, excuse me, by the Lord Jesus, that there is nothing unclean of itself, but to him that esteemeth anything to be unclean, to him it is unclean. Right. Amen.